Hi everyone, my name is Yulia Panchenko, I'm a Buddha photographer and in this video I'm going to show you my five best poses that my clients absolutely love and you don't need any furniture to actually do those poses. Uh, Janine is here with us today, she's so beautiful mm -hmm. and she's going to help us to, um, to do those poses uh, that you can use in your studio with your clients or models. Uh, we start with uh, pose number one by the wall. So Janine, if you can stand closer to the wall, uh, cross your leg, yeah, that's beautiful. Pop your hip and bring your arms up by holding your wrist. Beautiful, relax your fingers. So it's very important here to cross a uh, leg just like that uh, to create one triangle. Uh, bend it, uh, push the hip uh, a little bit and bring your arms and separate it from your your hand that's beautiful so we by posing this way we create uh, triangles and we show the entire beautiful uh, and show creating those by creating those curves we show how beautiful it is um, you can ask your model to look at the window close your eyes breathe through your mouth then look back at the camera and give a little bit of smile yeah Look at the camera and give a little bit of smile. That's beautiful. So from here, I would ask her to step forward and hug yourself, kind of do the same, similar. It's a similar pose, um, just a little bit different implementation. And look at the, at the window. Uh, you can see that she's kind of hugging herself, uh, posing, holding her arm within her body. This way we um, we show the hourglass shape and again we bend our, um, her arms, her leg, creating those triangles so it's, it looks really cute. Again from here you can ask your model to show multiple different expressions by looking at the camera or looking away at, from the, um, looking away at the window or at your light. From here we, I will ask you Janine to sit down Sit down for me, please, and bring this leg in. That's beautiful. And again, yeah, kind of hug yourself. Again, the same rule, uh, creating our glass shape with her arms. And what is very important here is to ask your model to point your toes. So keep them flat, just put them, yeah, completely. So it looks pretty still, but as soon as she points her toes, both, yeah, you can put your leg kind of on, yeah, right there. So it looks absolutely different and looks pretty. Yeah, beautiful. So f this is very, very popular pose that I use pretty much for every client here in my studio and everybody loves it. And they always want me to print them big for them and to put it on the wall. Um, from here, I will ask you to lay down, please. Beautiful. Um, just like that, arch your back. Uh, we're bending um, legs to create two triangles here and bring your arms up to your hair. Beautiful. So here we create another triangle right there. And if this is bothering you, this arm on the floor, you can always bring it up just like that and ask to kind of hold another arm and from here you can also ask your model to tilt your face towards the camera uh, look straight at the camera yeah just like that creating another another shot make sure that um, there is a separation between her arm and her chin it's very important if you don't separate let's not let's keep it closer so look up Janine Perfect, and bring this arm closer to your face even more. So we're losing the, and it also depends on the, the client and the model, but sometimes when it's too close, we lose the shape. We don't have separation between um, her arms and her chin, and that creates bulk that it's not really flattering. So from here, I will ask you to turn sideways for me, please. It's beautiful. Extend your legs a little bit more. Make sure you're on the line, like straight on the line. Beautiful. 
you can actually extend this leg and bend another one. Beautiful. Yeah, just like that. Perfect. And again, the same concept. Uh, you can see that there is a separation between her chin and her arm. It's very important. And you can here ask your model to breathe through your mouth, close your eyes, just like that, to add a little bit more sensuality. And yeah, or ask her to put your arm on her hip. Yeah, perfect. And bring it back like that, yeah. And look at the camera. That's gorgeous. That's pretty much it. Um, thank you so much, Janine. I hope uh, that was very helpful and I hope you can actually introduce those poses to your clients or to your models in your studio and make sure you like the video, uh, subscribe and hit the notification bell. I'll see you next time.